then I will see if there's somebody on the street that would like to have the rest of the food. Hello. Hi. Uh, driver, yeah. Wow. Oh. Do I look old? Hey. <laughs> 150. I know, I know. I'm just looking for the other one. What is it? <laughs> what is it? 30 minutes. Pure bliss. Oh, we're still. Sit down. She'll sit here. Sit down. Huh? She'll sit here. You sit here. I sit there. All oh, these guys are trying to sell me booze. Oh, guys. So hungry, so hungry. It's so late. I don't know what the prices are, so I just sort of say a random price that I'm happy with. So bad for you. So much oil. Nobody has my size of trainer. What a disaster. Delicious. You want some soup? Enjoy. Welcome to the video, guys. In this one, we are going to go and get some street food. But first, I need to go and take all this laundry to a laundromat in Bangkok because this is the reality of traveling so much. You only have one backpack and you need to wash the clothes sometimes. So I haven't done any laundry since I arrived in Thailand. So just now I've booked a taxi and we're gonna go to the laundromat first, quickly deposit the stuff and then head to Khoi San Road. Two. Yeah, my taxi driver is actually waiting outside, so I'm gonna go take the stuff to the to the laundromat. I've gone to the wrong floor though. Apparently, you have to go to floor 12 in this hotel in order to uh, to get out of here. I need to go up before I go down. Oh, is this 12? Oh, I should have gone to 12. <laughs> Yeah, so uh, we're gonna go to Khoi San Road and then there's another food market near there, so go and check that one out as well. But first, laundromat. Also, the other reason that I am getting a Grab, which is a taxi company that you can order taxis from here. And I'm taking a Grab because I've, if you've watched any of my other videos, you will know I've had a few incidents with the uh, the tuk-tuk drivers here which is unfortunate but they're just either they charge too much and I don't know the prices when I first arrived or uh, you know they take you to random places to try to pretend that you're buying stuff I don't know so yeah wasn't a good experience taking the tuk-tuks in Bangkok unfortunately um, but yeah I got a grab from the airport it was great and this is meant to be a luxury one, so we'll see. All right, that is my taxi there. How are you? Good, I'm, I'm okay, I'm okay. Yeah, a very nice taxi. It's nice and cool in here because of the air conditioning. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, it's hot today, yeah. But this is my first time going out because oh. I've been hiding from the heat. Because it's too hot. Do you have change of a thousand? Yeah. Oh, I'll be careful. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. Thank you, thank you. See you later. Bye. What are the prices? It's all just... Uh, Drop off, yeah, this one. How much? 200. Oh, just depends on the kilograms. Standard, warm, hot. Warm? All my dirty laundry all over the laundromat. I'm not sure what's going on here. She's waiting for someone. Not sure. The lady's on the phone, so yeah, we're trying to get this uh, laundry weighed. Figure out how much I'm gonna have to pay. No problem. You want me to fill this in? Okay. 
Oh. Speak, speak. speak English to the lady. Hello? Hi. Okay, I want to wash and dry. Yes. I don't have anything. Uh, maybe. Should we do standard? Is it standard cold? I'm looking at the, the board right now. It says standard cold 50. Uh, or is is it is is warm going to shrink is, is 60 i don't know you tell me what is the normal uh the normal temperature let's get my shoes back on oh my god guys i'm so starving oh you're you want me to help you <laughs> okay lady almost lost her glasses yeah so guys i'm so starving no thank you so much I haven't eaten anything all day. I was actually thinking yesterday I was eating so much at the street food that I'm putting on so much weight and it's so hard not to because I keep on eating everything. So I think I'm going to, uh, if I have extra food and I'm not hungry, I'm just tying my shoelaces. If I have extra food and I'm not hungry, I'm gonna keep it and not finish everything because I want to show you guys me tasting lots of food but I don't want to waste food. So I'm going to buy food, taste some of it, and then if I'm not hungry or I you know, want to try more food later and I want to save it, then I will get it packed and then I will see if there's somebody on the street that would like to have the rest of the food that I have so that it doesn't go to waste. So there you go, that's the new plan so we're not wasting food but I don't need to eat all the food that's on the channel because I don't want to get fat all right so that's the new plan see you later <laughs> so yeah I've got my laundry in to be done that's great 280 baht hopefully uh, hopefully they gave me the right change I didn't count it I'm sure they did and Let's go. Let's go to Khoi San Road. It's an interesting little street though. Random. Motorbikes here. It's like a garage or something. The guys are playing with watching or they're watching TV. Or they're just chilling. But yeah. This is what Bangkok is like. People just chilling out on the streets. <coughs> I think I need to get another grab taxi. But I might have a little negotiation with a tuk-tuk driver and see what they say. I'll just check the price from here to Khoi San Road. Because actually that taxi was uh, quite expensive because it was a premium one, so... Yeah. Yeah, it's like I, I just checked Grab, which is the app for ordering taxis, and it's like 160 for a Grab car. But I think I got a premium car earlier because the car I just said that I wanted to I wanted to like search for both the premium and the normal one so I ended up being like 250 so yeah anyway I think you can get tuk-tuks here for around a hundred hopefully they don't try and take me or maybe even less than a hundred so I'm gonna try and get to Khoi San Road for uh, let's say 70 baht what do I have here this is a hundred well, let's try, a, let's try, get it for a hundred. These guys are working hard, even though they try and scam me. Every time I, uh, I get one, but just because I'm a tourist. I feel like there are tourist prices here for everything. But yeah, I don't actually know what, uh, what this area is called, but it's hectic. Not that hectic, but yeah, people are unloading tires here, that type of thing. What's going on up there? Guys, I can't even concentrate, I can't even think because I'm so hungry. I have no idea. Let's see if one of these tuk-tuks is moving. Yeah. Khoi San Road? Yeah, yeah. How much? Uh, 200 baht. No, 100. Huh? 100. Uh, me, yeah. It's 100, I'm 100 only. You do? Yes or no? Fair enough, fair enough. It's like a 15 minute wait for a 
a, a taxi with grab and it's 160 so door and conditioning but I saved the weight and it's 100 but yeah they quote like very high prices to start how are you good no ham meter. Huh? No ham meter. Tuk tuk. No, yeah, it's a tuk tuk, yeah? Yeah, tuk tuk, no ham meter. Okay, okay. But it's a hundred Khoi Road, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. You okay, I'm okay. If you okay, then I'm okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm you. What's your name? My name is Won Chai. Won Cha? Yeah. Ah, Won Cha, nice to meet you. Uh, what? Your name? Philip. Philip? Yeah. Oh, I'm blessed. I don't know Nice to meet you, man. Yeah. How long have you been driving taxi uh, tuk tuk? How, yeah. how many years? Many years? Many. Five, five years? Five ten? Years. How many years? Uh, 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 a long time? A long time, ten years. And tuk tuk? Yeah. Yeah? Uh, uh, 17 years. 17? 17 years. Wow. Uh, but, I drive uh, 17 years. Wow. Incredible. All just in Bangkok? Yeah. Oh wow, amazing. And it's good? It's uh, looking around here. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, service in the bank up. Okay. And business is better after the pandemic? Yeah? Yeah. Good. Alright guys, I'll, t I'll check in with you uh, when we arrive at Khoisan Road. What age are you? Huh? How old are you? I'm uh, 50. 50? Yeah. You do not look 50. I'm 50, my friend. No way. Turn right, turn right, turn right. Let me see you. <laughs> yeah, 50, 50. 50? You don't yeah, look 50. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, strong. You're very strong for 50. Yeah, 50. You look younger than me, and I'm 35. No, 35. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, look at 35. No. Uh, do, I look, uh, do I look older than 35? How, how, how old? Uh, how, how old? 35. 35. 35. Oh. Do I look old? Hey. <laughs> this is Khoi San here? Yeah. Okay, great. Oh. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you so much. Here you go, that's for you. Okay, thank you. You're welcome, you're welcome. Nice. Thought I'd just give them 300 to be nice. Alright, so this is the... This is the street. I'm good, I'm just walking and looking. Thank you though. Just I'm just walking and having a look. Thank you so much. Yeah, this is Khoi San Road. Let's have a look around. It's my first time here. Everyone tells me about this, uh, this street being like one of the places that you have to visit. It's where all the tourists come. Do you mind if I film your food? Hello, Hello how are you? Oh, it looks delicious. <laughs> you tired? <laughs> nice, well... So this is it, this is it. That guy, that uh, taxi driver was so nice. The other, another guy recently asked me, what is this? Ooh, oh, I can't do it, I can't do it. I'm vegetarian. They have like bars in here, like Western type things. Bars over there. Very interesting. And then I guess they're gonna have some live music playing. But yeah, that guy was so nice. And I paid 350 for a... Looks so good. How are you? Delicious. <laughs> not just now, not just now. Cool. Guys doing some live music. So this is Khoi San Road. Anyway, what I was saying was, that guy was so nice. Somebody else, you know, scammed me the other or not scam me, over, overcharged me the other day, 350 for a very short journey. That was quite a long journey. He uh, he offered to like tell me about different places. So yeah, if people are nice, then it's good to give people extra money. But if people are just trying to scam you the whole time, then, you know, or overcharge you because you're a tourist, then yeah, no point in, uh, in uh, over, overpaying. You got to reward kindness. You got to reward honesty from people. And then, uh, yeah, just be hard, harsh to people that uh, are not uh, kind. That's my approach. But yeah, they're selling like sunglasses here, no pajamas. What else? 
doing tattoos. Ooh. Yeah, tattoo. Not for me, not for me. Thank you so much. The sun is starting to go down here, but the other night I tried to, uh, I just took about a 30 minute break there from filming because my brother called me from Louisiana because I'm going to be going back to the UK soon. So yeah, the light's going down a little bit more here and I'm going to use this as my opportunity to get a foot massage because I've been uh, searching for a foot massage in one of my other, in one of my other videos. So now's my chance. Hello. Hi. Can I, can I have a foot massage, please? Yes, outside. Uh, one is hour. It, is it air conditioned inside? Yeah, yeah, yes. I go inside. Okay. And okay. half an hour, 30 minutes. Okay. Okay. I'm in her. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hello. 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 I take my shoes off. Yeah. Oh. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Oh, it's nice and cold in here. So let's see what they do. Although I'll probably have to be quiet. Maybe I'll sit over here. Hi, how are you? Oh, I pay here first. Okay. Time massage, oil massage, foot massage, 150. Okay. Hi, uh, I think I'll just have a foot massage, half an hour. That's uh, 140? 150. I know, I know. I'm just looking for the other one. What is the, <laughs> what is a 10 though? I don't know which one's a 10. Five and five. Ten. Total 10. Okay, cool. Thank you. Oh, we're going through here. Thank you. Just over here. So I should take my socks off. Guys, don't judge my feet. I haven't had my toenails clipped. I'll need to go for a pedicure as well. Okay, these my socks go in here, yeah? All right, so yeah, first things first, we wash the feet. Put them in here. And I should roll these up. Thank you. I've never had a foot massage before. Yeah, I very much need a, a what do they call it? Pedicure? Pedicure. First washing them. Foot number two. Put it here and then I come with you. Okay. Thank you. Okay, we go this way. Is this the seat? Okay. Oh, thank you. Got the pillows there. Oh, oh this goes back. Great. Oh, could get used to this. Oh, I need to move up. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, how's that? Okay. Thank you so much. <laughs> Guys, have you ever had a foot massage in Thailand before? Oh, so you do the whole leg. Should I move, push this right up? what they do. Put some oil on there. Thirty minutes. Pure bliss. Gotta sit back and relax while I get my foot massaged like this. I'm gonna sit back and relax this and then I'll I'll show you the rest of Khoi San Road once I'm very hungry though I've not eaten anything so soon we will eat the technique wow you can tell that she's been doing it for a long time <laughs> now we've got some sort of pressing with the towel down on top of my leg squishing it down I think we're almost done with the first leg. We'll be moving on to the second leg soon. I will do it, don't worry. Okay. 
Thank you, thank sit you. Down. Oh, we're still sit down. Sit down. Huh? Sit here. You sit here. I sit there. Oh right, okay. Turn. I turn around. Okay, go, go, go. Oh, a little back club as well. She had to get on a stool. <laughs> so I'm too tall. Thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Foot massage over. That was good. Just get my shoes back on and then we'll go and explore. Try to get some food somewhere here on Ho San Ro. Thank you so much. Alright, guys, we're back out on the street. Now it's very light here. Are there all the lights are on because it's so uh, so dark lots of loud music playing in all the different uh, bars and that type of thing and you can see we've got uh, loads of shops on the left hand side these guys are selling uh, sunglasses pajamas what else? Hello, brother. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you and these guys are selling jewelry You've got all the music playing from the nightclubs, all these guys are trying to, alright, what's up? All these guys are trying to sell me booze. Should I go shopping for clothes? Let's see. Maybe not just now. What's going on here? Hello. <laughs> We've got uh, kebabs and meat. And then fruit. Okay, it's a bit, bit, bit quieter, a bit less hectic here. But yeah, this is uh, this is Thailand. This is Thailand. This is Bangkok. This is Ko Ko San Ro. Hello, how are you? Hello. This guy's doing spring rolls. No, I'm okay, but thank you. Okay, so it looks like this is like the end of Ko San Ro. Okay, it's just one street that comes all the way along here, but they didn't really look as if they had a lot of uh, food. No thanks. There's weed guys just uh, selling marijuana there. More food street stuff here. Yeah. So it's just one street that runs uh, runs along there. But it doesn't really look like somewhere I want to have food. So I think I might. I think I might take a, a tuk tuk and go to uh, to another spot that I've heard has good street food. So I'm going to do a bit of research and then I will let you guys know where we're going. But that is Koh San Ro. All right, guys, I have booked. We're going to Pratunam Market, street food market, I believe. It's around five kilometers from here. So I've booked my grab and we're going to go and check, uh, check that out. Still starving, still haven't eaten anything all day, apart from one packet of crisps. Nice bus. But we're going to get something to eat there because this street is a little bit too hectic for me, if I'm honest. Although, yeah, it's just one street that you, you walk down. It's, uh, yeah, very interesting coming, coming there anyway, because I've heard a lot about it. You uh, took, took, is this yours? Can I go uh, Pratunam Market? It's uh, 100? It's 100. It's 200 for a grab car and they have AC. No. One uh, twenty. One fifty. Okay. No, no, I'm doing one twenty maximum. Okay. No problem. Hello. I want to go to Pratunam Market. One hundred. Yeah. No, no, no. 
crazy. It says 195 for an AC car on Grab, so. Let's see, I'll ask some of these other guys. But yeah, that's the difference, isn't it? Hey bro, you wanna go to Pratunam Market? Yeah. 100. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> no. What's the price? Coffee game. Huh? Oh. oh, well, maybe one. Maybe see you later. <laughs> maybe the price is not 100. You need people to say no to you sometimes and then you kind of figure out what the right price should be. Let's see. I'll offer this guy 150. Hello? I want, I want to go to Pratunam Market. 150. 150. Pratunam Market. Pratunam. Pratunam Market. Yeah. 150. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Nice. Seems like a nice guy. Yeah. So let's go and taste some street food. Oh, guys. So hungry. So hungry. It's so late. But I wanted that foot massage. Finally got one. Yes. I can tick that off my list of things that I have done in Thailand. I need the full body at some point, but not before I go up north. I'm going to go to Chiang Mai tomorrow. So we're gonna go and explore the jungle after having experienced some amazing things in uh, Bangkok. It's time to get into the countryside. It's here? It's lit. He's asking for directions. Alright, yeah. We just take a left here, I'm following the map. It's okay. You drop me here. Yeah. No problem. Otherwise we have to drive for like 12 minutes. So let's just get out here and take a walk down the street. Burn off even more calories. Uh, okay, one second. Here you go. Is that 150, yeah? Okay. Oopa. All right, so let's take a walk. That's me falling over again. As per usual in my videos. So yeah, we've got like fruit stalls here, fruit juice, more of these uh, tuk-tuks cutting around. Some of them are honest and some are a nightmare. So yeah, it just depends. Pratunam Post Office. Yeah, so we've got some, uh, some restaurants up here. People sitting down and eating with the family. Today is uh, Thursday. So yeah, everyone's coming out on a Thursday evening with their families and me coming out to get some street food and show you guys around. But there's a car coming. What is this? Uh, what is this? Is this some sort of idol? Yeah, they've got the, the elephant as well. I need to learn the name of the elephant god that they have. But, uh, but yeah, there's a rabbit here as well. There's a few rabbits. There's a rabbit here and a rabbit there. I wonder what the rabbit represents. And then there's this god as well. I think I saw this one at, uh, at a shrine the other day. You come this way. No worries. Yeah, so Pratanam. I think Pratanam is in this direction. So let's try to find it. So it looks like we climb over this uh, little gate here and then we can enter into the market. So, yeah, this looks like the start of it. But it looks like people are starting to close up. I hope it's not too late for the market. It's only 8 p.m. Yeah, surely not. But yeah, look, they've got some uh, clothes shops here. It's a cute, uh, cute little thing that they've got here. I guess this is per semi-permanent then. It's here most of the time, this building. 
we've got a 7-Eleven and then look this is uh, some food stalls here just the food here is just unbelievable everywhere you look in in Bangkok you just get delicious tasty food oh. Whoa. there's a soup do I want soup? Not sure. Ooh, it looks so good. 150 for one of these fish. Incredible. Maybe uh, Pratinam is down this in, in this direction. Sunglasses. I will need to get some sunglasses at some point. But not yet. So they have all these little hotels as well. Seems kind of a little bit seedy, not gonna lie. Some places here in uh, Bangkok, you're not sure, uh, you, people are offering you all sorts of interesting things. Let's put it that way. This is Kit Kats. And then this is the night market. So the night market is not just food, it's also, uh, also clothes. You can pretty much get anything that you're uh, you need. And given I've just put my laundry in, I might buy a T-shirt for tomorrow. But I wonder what the prices will be like for these designer goods. I'm terrible at negotiating, though. Well, sometimes I can be okay at negotiating, but um, yeah, not the best. I don't know what the prices are, so I just sort of say a random price that I'm happy with. I'm okay, thank you so much. Hmm, okay, I'm going to go... Oh, I'm gonna squeeze through here, thank you. Yeah, I'm going to go to where the food is, which is over in this direction. Ooh, my, uh, my camera just ran out of battery, but I found this little stall that does these things. How much is, are these? This one group, 30 baht. This 30 baht for one of, the, one of them. Okay, I will just have one. Yeah? What you can take powder? Uh, spicy. Okay. Thank you. Oh, and you put the powder on it. And you shake it. what I'm looking for. 30 you said? No, yes, 30. Keep the change. Oh, okay. No, you keep it, you keep it. Thank you, thank you. See you later. Ooh, let's eat this uh, spicy potato. This is just an appetizer. Okay. Try it. Spicy potatoes. So they give you these things with it as well. They give you these little chopstick things or these six. They put the spiciness. So this is this is what it looks like. Oh my god, the spices on that are amazing. It's spicy, but it's also sweet. Mm, so bad for you. So much oil and starch, but still, it's delicious. Wow, oh my God. I'm gonna eat this so quickly, guys, because I'm so hungry. Wow. Oh. I think it was worth it starving myself all day just to have this taste. I know I mentioned earlier that I'm gonna get food away. I don't think I'm going to, I don't think I'm going to be giving any food away. Oh my god! I 
don't think they fried it again though, it's a little bit cold. But Hello Hotel! Yeah, it's very good. But it's very delicious. Recommend you guys getting this potato crispy potato fritter. Ooh, I've got stuff all over my fingers. Anyway, yeah. Let's continue the video after I finish this. All finished. Good times. Let's go exploring some more. I want to find some more food. But what do we do with this? Trash. I should have put it over there. I don't want to throw it in the bin. Or I don't want to throw it. I don't want to throw it on the ground. Hmm. But yeah, this market seems to be more about clothes than it does about food. But it's still very interesting. I might try and get some uh, trainers. Hey man. You uh, you have size 12 UK? Nah? Okay. Nobody has my size of trainer. What a disaster. Every country I go to, they all laugh at me whenever I tell them that I'm a size 12. Guys, it just goes never ending over here. I'm going to try somebody else and see if they've got my size of uh, trainer. Maybe we can pick some up. Hey man, do you have size 12 trainers? No? Okay, thanks. Unfortunately, no. Chicken. Are these prawns? Are these cooked prawns? I think I might have one of these skewers. Hello. Yeah, 100. For the whole thing, it's a lot. It's cheap. Uh, but no, it's okay, it's okay. Thank you so much. It's gonna to be too difficult to eat there in the middle of nowhere. Too difficult to eat that, I think, without space. Oh. Here. Hi, how are you? You have a fish soup? Tom Yum soup? to get the menu. I can show you. Uh, I think I will have the Tom Yum. Wait, where's the Tom Yum? Yum. Oh. Hello. Papaya salad. That looks good as well. What do you want? I don't know, I'm just deciding. But I think uh, you have a spicy soup, a spicy shrimp soup. Is that the tom yum? Yeah. Spicy tom yum with with seafood. Yeah. Can I have that one? Yes. Oh, that looks good. So hot and spicy soup with seafood and fish. Yeah, I'll have that one. Yeah. There's no chicken in this, no. Eat here. Uh, eat here, and I will also have something else. A little bit side. Oh, same, same. Yeah, I will have the big, this one. The big. Yeah, and I will also have something else. Uh, some noodle? No, um, you have a fish dish? Let me look at this, but I bring the soup. Yeah? Thank you so much. Can I, uh, can I have that? Thank you. And can I also have a Diet Coke? A Coke Zero? Yeah, thank you. One Coke Zero, thank you. Uh, shrimp spring roll. 
Or deep fried shrimp. No, I'll get the shrimp spring roll. And then maybe I'll get some sort of fish. Fish. Dolly fish. Stir fried dolly fish. Some of these look amazing as well. Look at these dishes that they have. Stir fried bitter melon with egg. They have stir fried mixed vegetables, morning glory, squid oyster sauce. Thank you so much. Do you have pad thai? Can I have uh, one pad thai? And then can I also have a stir fried? Uh, so I will, I will, will have the soup. Yeah. And then I will have the shrimp spring rolls. Shrimp. Yeah. And um, actually, sorry, the soup, vegetable spring rolls. Vegetable spring rolls, no shrimp, just vegetable. Yeah, vegetable. And then, uh, can I get pad thai? Pad thai shrimp. Uh, no, just pad thai on its own. You do. Where? Stir fried noodle. Oh. Okay, I will. I'll have the. I'll have the seafood pad thai. Seafood. Yeah, that's it. Thank you. What is the name of this place? The one. Yeah. That the name. Cool. It's so hot. I got so hot last night as well. Trying to find a massage. I think after this, I will taste the food. Then I'm gonna go and buy another t-shirt. Because this one is beginning, beginning to get a little bit sweaty. Ooh, the spring rolls have arrived. Vegetable spring rolls, that is. Let's get a dip of this in here. Oh my god. Mmm. That sauce has like a tangy taste to it. But man. I'm gonna eat every last drop. I, I've ordered a lot. I ordered the pad thai, I ordered the spring rolls, and I also ordered the soup. So, yeah, I'm gonna be very, very full, but I'm probably gonna eat all of it. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. If I need to get a takeaway bag. I've seen spring rolls with peas. Usually it's like if I get carrot and lettuce and stuff, but the peas are an interesting addition. Tell me more. Do the spring rolls usually come with peas in Thailand? Mm. Yum. <laughs> How is your food? It's good. Oh. Orange. Oh, nice. And this is the soup. Wow. And there's like a fire going on in here underneath there to keep it hot I hope it doesn't burn me and then I guess they've given me this little uh, little plate to keep me let me plate it up put that there try and get some of my seafood soup from this into the plate but yeah this uh, this creamy soup with loads of shrimp inside is just exactly what I'm looking for. Is that a mushroom? And then there's all these uh, salad leaves, mushrooms, looks like spicy kind of paprika sauce. That looks like calamari. You're in there. Oh, thank you so much. Uh -huh. Thank you. Let's get one more of these and then we'll tuck it to the soup. Okay. This is the moment of truth. How tasty is the soup? Good. It's so hot on fire. It has such good presentation to try and keep the soup hot. The soup, the soup always gets cold. Okay, let's try, let's try. So this is the calamari. Oh my god. It's uh, got lemon juice or, or uh, lime juice in it as well. And it's quite spicy, but not too spicy. 
let's try some of this. Is it, I think it might be coconut. Yeah, it's like a coconut uh, soup. <laughs> coconut soup with some spices. I think some lime, not sure. And then, uh, yeah, some seaweed, some, uh, some seafood. Let's try one of these mushrooms. I don't think I've ever seen a mushroom quite like this one. Look. I love how the mushrooms in different countries are all different uh, shapes and sizes. Oh my god, that's so good. God, I'm so happy to be here when there's so uh, so much good seafood to be eaten. Speaking of which, whoa, is this uh, ginger? I think this is ginger. Excuse me. Excuse me. You know if this is ginger? Is this ginger? What? Oh, you don't speak English? Okay, okay. No worries. That's good though. I think it's ginger. Wow, delicious. Okay, I'm gonna try some of the noodles now. Uh, I'll have it first without and then I'll probably wait. Oh, it's, I think it's got egg through it. I don't think that's is that chicken? No, it's just egg. They put egg inside and then it's uh, seafood. Uh, yeah, so let's try it. Sublime, sublime, formidable. Delicious. Needs a little bit more salt for my tasting and a little bit more chili. I like it very spicy. Okay. Let's put some of that in there. And then let's get some salt. Okay. Is that salt? Hopefully that's salt. And then this is some sort of uh, sauce, like a soy sauce. Let's try some of this. Why not? And there's one more sauce here, so let's put some of this on it as well. Why not? Okay. Let's put all the condiments. I don't know which condiments they're offering us, but we're gonna just try all of them. Okay. Wow. I've just made it about 10 times better. Ooh, spicy. Very spicy. Let's get some of this calamari. So good. Okay, I'm gonna try one of these prawns. One of these. Guys, the seafood here is like next level. Oh my god. Honestly, I'm overwhelmed. Okay, I'm gonna try my best to finish this food. I'm still super hungry, so yeah, I'll probably. Uh, Alright guys, very delicious, so good. I'm gonna finish my food and then I'm gonna go and buy a t-shirt, so yeah. Ooh, okay, I tried my best, but I finished one small plate of soup. I tried my best, but it defeated me. I finished one small plate of soup. I finished my noodles, I finished most of the spring rolls, but the soup was too much. I overdid my order. Oh, but I'm so relieved that I've actually eaten something. But yeah, I've tasted a little bit of the soup, but I think this is a perfect thing to get them to pack up because I haven't had much of it. Yeah, so let's see if somebody will do that for me. Hi, can I have one of these for my soup? Thank you. You have a lid as well? Thank you so much. All right. I guess uh, I guess I'm gonna do it myself. Maybe I'll ask them to help me. Hi. Oh, okay. Hi. Oh. Can uh, 
Thank you, thank you. It's okay, they're empty. Can you... Should take home? Yeah, take away. Thank you so much. Let's have one more of these. And just the bell as well. Thank you. The seafood in particular. Wow. Incredible. These aren't my favorite spring rolls in the entire world. And the, but the soup was delicious, but I just, I, I had some of it, but yeah, I tasted it, but the noodles were just too much for me, especially after all that potato that I had earlier. So yeah. Okay, we've got our bag. She's just getting the bill for me. Okay. How much? 540. 540, okay, cool, thanks. This place got kind of busy for a few minutes there while, while I was eating, but it seems to have uh, died off again. Just gonna wait for my change and then, um, and then we can go and give the soup to somebody and quickly buy a new t-shirt. Thank you so much. I will take, uh, you keep uh, that. Thank okay. you. No worries. Okay. 150 as a tip all right so the next uh, the next thing we need to do well we've got to do two things we've got to find somebody that looks like they need a nice warm bowl of soup and then we need to buy a t-shirt or a shirt actually a nice shirt would be good light shirt. Let's have a look in here. Let's see. It says extra large. Doesn't look very large to me. Hmm. Let's continue our walk. And we might be able to find someone that needs some help or looks hungry. Let's see. Oh my god. They look amazing. What about down here? I don't feel like it is. No, I'm good, I'm good. I'm trying to get rid of food. I'm not trying to buy more food, I'm trying to get rid of food. Let's see. I'm full. I've eaten already, thank you. I've gone from being the most hungry I've ever been in my entire life to being the most full I've ever been in my life and walking after doing it. So it's a lot. But this is a new area that we're walking into. New fashion arena. Yeah. Seems a bit quieter around here. Looks like everybody's uh, breaking down for the night here. I don't know if this area is they're closing it or yeah they must have been open earlier because this whole area you know, it looks uh, yeah. looks like it's just been people have just been here but they must close this night market a little bit earlier you guys can't even see me now okay so we're getting out onto the main road no t-shirt for me priority is good now giving away the soup. Yeah. There's nice air conditioning coming off all these buildings. Whew. Exactly what I needed. So yeah, there's a platinum fashion mall. There's like a street food thing over here. Look. I wonder what's going on. But yeah, let's stay on this side. I'm going to try and cross over. Because this little area looks kind of dingy, but... 
Looks like there's some homeless people sleeping underneath here. I don't want these two guys to fight over it, but I'll give it to one of them. You want some soup? You want some soup? Enjoy. No worries. Share some with him. Share with him. See you later. All right, guys. Yeah, well, I'm gonna just end this video here. We managed to get rid of the soup. So that's good. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. And uh, if you haven't already, hit subscribe on my channel, like this video, and I will see you guys in the next one.